up, it's Lauren with On The Edge Fitness, and today I'm going to be covering the push-up. I know that sounds simple, but after two C-sections, since it's been exactly five years today, it did kind of destroy my push-up, and it's actually destroyed a lot of females' push-ups, unfortunately, because of the core function. So what I'd like to do is just go over a few progressions to really get your push-up back, and this will also help some of the men out there. So when testing your push-up, you want to be able to make sure you can at least hold a high plank with a proper spine alignment. So what you're going to do is you're going to get your hands right underneath your shoulders. You don't want them super wide. And you want to keep your shoulders away from your ears, lats engaged. And from here, you want to make sure your lower back's not sagging. That's a huge part here. So what you want to do is you want to try to tuck your pelvis under a little bit to make sure those lower abdominals are firing properly. So from here, if you don't feel like you can move through a full range of motion push-up, keeping your elbows tight and back on up, then that's where it's time to get a higher surface. Okay, so with my experience, most females that have had kids should actually start their push-up from a higher surface, whether it's your bar or a bench or these handles. So basically, you're gonna Find a nice high plank position, so now I'm in a, at, a, at a surface here, and my shoulders are pulled away from my ears. Again, we are going to gently tuck your pelvis under, okay? You just want to make sure, basically, that your, your lower back's not sagging so your neck takes over. So it's shoulders pulled down, tuck your pelvis under a little bit, keeping your elbows close to your side. Inhale, bring your elbows down behind you. Breathe behind the shield as you come on up. Now notice it's just a moving plank. Breathe it in and up. Now if this is way too easy for you, that's when you start to go lower and lower until your core is completely functioning properly and you can move at a proper push-up right on the ground. I hope that helps. Let me know how you do.